England have moved ahead of Germany in the race for an extra Champions League spot next season. Europe's top leagues have been going head-to-head -head this season in a bid to earn an additional spot in next season's competition, with two countries to do so ahead of the introduction of the new Champions League format. The continent's premier competition will be expanded from next year for the first time since 2003 to 2004, growing from 32 clubs in an eight-group style to 36 clubs in what is known as a Swiss format. It will see teams play eight matches in the qualification stage, four home and four away, with the top eight teams progressing to the last 16 and 9th to 24th facing off in two-legged playoffs. Two of the extra spots will be awarded to the best-performing leagues in Europe this season, and, thanks to West Ham's win over Freiburg on Thursday night, England have raced ahead of Germany in the bid to earn the extra spot. England have five teams remaining in Europe, with Arsenal and Manchester City in the Champions League and Liverpool and West Ham bidding for Europa League success. Aston Villa are looking to win the Conference League having beat Ajax on Thursday. Germany, meanwhile, have Bayern Munich and Borussia Dortmund left in the Champions League, with Bundesliga leaders Bayer Leverkusen progressing in the Europa League. Italy are far ahead in the race for the extra spots, which is decided by UEFA's association coefficient rankings. Serie A currently had 17.714 points in the ranking, ahead of Germany with 16.357 and England with 16. While the league seems certain to earn one spot despite not having a team left in the Champions League, it is a straight shootout between England and Germany, with the former having the advantage of extra sides left in Europe and the favourites to win all three competitions. A win for a club in Europe is worth two points in the rankings, and a draw one. Bonus points can be collected by progressing in each competition, with more earned for the higher calibre of tournament. The total points are then divided by the number of teams in Europe from the nation at the start of the season. In the Premier League, the total is divided by 7 rather than 8 due to West Ham qualifying via winning the Conference League. While England's success in Europe could be good news for the likes of Tottenham and Manchester United, who have been chasing a top four spot this term, it will also benefit those lower down the table. Rather than needing to leapfrog Aston Villa, Spurs would reach Europe's elite competition with a fifth place finish, the position they currently occupy. Manchester United, meanwhile, would only need to make up six points rather than eight to achieve Eric Den Hag's target of Champions League qualification. It would also mean qualification for the Europa League and Conference League would in theory be easier, with the spots for qualification moving down. That would see sixth and seventh qualify for the Europa League assuming a Champions League side win the FA Cup, spots currently occupied by United and West Ham, while 8th, currently Brighton, would earn a Conference League spot. If, for example, West Ham won the Europa League and entered the Champions League, the qualification spot for the Europa League in the Premier League would drop to 8th. Aston Villa's place in the Europa League would not be reallocated if they win the Conference League and reach the competition via their league position.
There could be up to 11 Premier League teams in Europe next season, but it would require an English side to win all three competitions and finish outside the top eight.